Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, May 29th, and I am at work. As I mentioned before, we had an Arizona walkout where the teachers left for five days, so we are spending five extra days extending the school year. We're doing professional development. We're doing other types of meetings, so I am here bright and squirrely. I went to Starbucks already, and they were out of vanilla syrup, so I had to get the toffee nut, which is still really good. It's very sweet. I also got my spicy chorizo sandwich and my egg bites that I love. So I'm just gonna get inside. I have about 25 minutes, so I'm gonna go find my place in the meeting room, and then I'm probably gonna go in my room and kind of do a few things. There are some things I need to get done in there, like pick up trash, clean up some stuff. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna try and capture a little bit of the PD today and this week. This is gonna be like a little week-long vlog, just as much as I can get in there. Perhaps some lunches with Jennifer, um, working in my classroom, just basically anything I can capture. So if you guys are along for the ride, then grab a snack, grab a coffee, and join me. Okay guys, so I just walked into my room and let me just remind you that the janitor has not been in here since the last day of school. So this is the mess <laughs> that we left. There's like a thing of trash over there and somebody's like wet socks are in that corner. What a disaster. So this is pretty much all I have left to pack up and take home is just this little corner and it looks like more but it's actually not a lot. The cart's already packed up and ready for me to roll out. And then I just have these two white bookshelves, which I think I might take home and use in my house. And then if I need them in my classroom, I can just go get a couple more because they're like 30 bucks at Ikea and super easy to put together. So this is all that I have left. It's probably about two loads just because a lot of it's like bigger and <coughs> all my privacy folders need to come as well and just little random bits and bobs. I did decide to leave this here though, so I'm gonna put that out on Friday. We're gonna have like a teacher garage sale kind of thing where we like put everything we don't want out in the hallway and people can kind of like walk by and take what they want. And I won't be taking anything, but I will be putting a lot of stuff out there. So I'm just gonna spend these next like 15 minutes just picking up all of the trash off the floor because I never, never expect my janitor to do that. And I knew he wouldn't be in here until like this week. So, so I purposely did not clean it up because I just knew that I would be able to do it later. I'm gonna check emails just in case there is something there for me. And then I will go ahead and go into the PD. So let's get this shawl or all. I wanted to show you guys that I did earn medals for my class maintaining their expected growth on our district assessment which is really awesome especially considering I wasn't here for half of the year because I was on maternity leave it's a great feeling knowing that even though you were gone you were able to like keep the learning and I don't know it just feels good to me I don't know I don't really like harp on like standardized testing, but our district is really like, they recognize teachers that, and when their class performs well. So even though I don't harp on it, it's still really nice to know. And they give us these little medals. Last year my class exceeded the growth expectation, but I am super pleased with just being able to maintain growth when I wasn't here for half of the time. So that is a great accomplishment.
Hey Sam, what's up? You're on YouTube right now. What's up YouTube? Remember to smash that like button. <laughs> smash it. <laughs> oh yeah, that face is going on since you put my ugly face on my... Yeah, uh-huh. So, this is my classroom, guys. Taking up the whole garage. I don't know if this is gonna fit in a five by 10 storage unit. Do you think well, it will? Well, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cause if anything oh, doesn't fit, unit. we can put it in my garage. Up on the shack, on the rack. Yeah, a lot of stuff will fit up there. So this is everything. These are gonna go in my house. I'm gonna just put these in my closet. So those won't take up much space. And then I think I'll put this one in my office in the front room to hold all the baskets of toys. This one right here. That box is empty, we can dispose of it. There's everything. <sighs> I know. So now we're packing up the new car. Oh, I didn't tell the vlog yet. So we traded in our Tacoma for a new smaller but slash family friendly car because the Tacoma was not very family friendly. The car seat barely fit in the back seat and both of us have the baby a lot. So it just wasn't working out. So we got a new RAV and um, I bought it last night and now we have two RAVs. We have one 2011 RAV and we have a 2018 RAV and they're pretty affordable vehicles. So if you're looking for a nice family friendly vehicle that's in the lower price range, the RAVs are great. All the important things are done. Hey guys, so I didn't vlog today because I was running around crazy trying to get checked out, but I am in the car, Cash is here, and we are leaving. We're leaving. It is so bittersweet leaving this place and I said my goodbyes to everyone. I said goodbye to Jennifer and we both teared up. And But it's okay because I know that I'm gonna see them. I know that I'm gonna stay in touch with them. And this place has like been home and it's sad, but it is so exciting. So anyway, that is gonna be the end of today's vlog. I'm going home and I get to stay home. So thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.